And while instead of their trademark red today, white as the PM rolled into La Hoqueta this morning for a unity walk in the area, Crystal Wilson tells us that PM candidate for the La Hoqueta Talparo constituency, Foster Cummings, has committed to returning to the area soon to address issues raised by both the young and old. White tees with the word unity written at the back was the preferred choice of apparel for supporters of the People's National Movement as they joined the Hoketa Talparo candidate Foster Cummings on a unity walk through the area on Sunday morning. Rain failed to stop the scheduled unity walk as Mr. Cummings was flanked by Labour Minister Jennifer Batiste Primus and Rural Development and Local Government Minister Kazim Hossein. The PNM General Secretary told TTT News the initiative for Sunday's event was suggested by the young people from the area. He said there were many concerns raised and that he will return soon to have the issues addressed. As I walk from house to house, the response has been tremendous. People are coming out of their homes to meet us. Although it is not a traditional uh, campaigning walk, people are anxious to see their candidate and meet their candidate. And they have been coming out and showing an an outpouring of support. Uh, we have two ministers, uh, Minister Primus and Minister Kazim Hussein, who in their own right uh, seem to be quite popular in this community. And people are anxious to come out and meet them and greet them. Lending support to Mr. Cummings on Sunday, Ministers Kazim Hussein and Jennifer Batiste Primus are both confident Mr. Cummings is the candidate best suited to bring positive change to an area stigmatized by crime. And I am sure Foster Cummings is a gentleman, he's an honest person, and I am asking the people of this community to, to support him on an election day when the results are counted on Monday night. We will be victorious, God willing. The young people have a lot of great ideas and we want to embrace those ideas and integrate those ideas as, as part and parcel of the plan in going forward. Also joining today's March for Unity was political leader of the new national vision, Fuad Abu Bakr, who endorsed the PNM initiative, saying it was a step in the right direction. Trinidad and Tobago does not belong to PNM, to UNC, to NNV. It belongs to all the people of Trinidad and Tobago. And we want leaders who can understand that, balance the, the society, and cater to the needs, in particular, of those who are really in a bad position. Among the issues raised by members of the community, the need for sustainable employment to be able to better care for their families. Crystal Wilson, TTT News.